So my first question: um, Did you meet before the shooting of, of the movie of this movie, and uh, do you had some rehearsals? Yes, yes, we met first time I think three three and a half weeks before we started the shooting, and we're lucky to have the opportunity yes, to rehearse like once or twice a week or three times a week. So we were yeah, spent time together. And on the shooting, uh, how it was uh, your relationship together? <laughs> It was good. It was uh, yeah. because we had the rehearsals. Yes. We already kind of knew exactly what we were doing. And Lily made us watch a lot of films beforehand too, so we sort of knew the world that we were living in. Yes, and um, I think we, we we didn't talk so much on the on the set, right? Because everything was so quiet. Yes. Uh, but. Uh, Yeah, we, we just had a good connection anyway, yeah. so yeah. there were no words required. What did you like in the in the script the first time you read it? What we, what what, we liked? Well, yeah. Um, I, liked, I, I liked, I mean, there were so many scenes and we, we thank you very much. Thank you. Um, we had so many, we had a couple of drafts that we, I mean, Lily is just really gifted in writing this, this, the situations that she creates. Is our, I mean, it's really fun to read, and fun to act. It's I really family. liked. Um, I like the fact that my character mostly killed bad people. So you know, she's not. Yes, she's like a sheriff. Exactly. Yeah. So I'm really interested in characters like that, where it exists somewhere in between. Yeah. That's how I think people are. You know, we all have the dark side and the light side, and so I, I was really excited about the idea of playing a character who, you know, you never really know yes. if she's doing the right thing or not, and are you on her side or not. I, I like that she was in the gray area. Right. I like my character because he suffers so much, <laughs> and he's not compl and he's not complaining yes. <laughs> until one point. So and. Uh, She's a vampire, so she 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 passed through a lot of things in her life, I think. Exactly, yeah, so. because she's lived a long time. Yes. And before we started shooting, um, I went to Lily's house, and she had a whole timeline of you know these are all the years you lived through, these yes. are all the different. So for me, even though you don't see it in the film, yes, there's a lot I knew about my own history about. How I became a vampire. Who was my family before? All of that stuff. So. How old is she? <laughs> She's like 180 years old. Around <laughs> almost 200. Yeah. You can see it only in her eyes. Yes. <laughs> Do you have some good memories on the shooting? Something. Uh... Um, I also have bad, not really bad <laughs> memories. No, I, would, I wouldn't say bad. Actually, I mean, when you look back, you... Uh, it was a very passionate it, set. Intense, it was it very was intense. intense. Yeah, there was we, a lot of emotion. And we had night shots of, like, two or three weeks we were shooting at night, which was very intense and uh, kind of depressing at some point. But, um, you know, it's just being together with all that wonderful crew. It's a we had the best crew, yeah. yeah. And our um, our base camp, it was in the basement of a church. Okay. So every day after we would film, we would go down there and a couple times we would just have big dance parties. <laughs> we just put the music on the highest volume and everybody would start dancing. And there was also a couple nights because we would shoot at night, so we would finish at maybe seven in the morning. Yes. Yes. And then from seven to nine in the morning, We would all just party and drink with each other. Yes. So it was a really a special crew because normally you get sick of people. You're like, I just want to go home. Yeah. And this was like, we never wanted to. We were all trapped in this town together. Yeah. And so for me, that that was a lot of fun. Was just being with that team of people. To live like a vampire. And, live, and to live like a vampire, exactly. I, I say sometimes when I'm walking alone at night, 
if it's a scary place, I just kind of <laughs> I like to like pretend I'm hurt just to get that yes. courage of like, yeah. you know what, if anybody wants to mess with me, yeah. I'll just kill them. Yeah. <laughs> it's good to, to have that thought with you. Know, it saves you. <laughs> uh, do you feel close of your character of the movie? I absolutely do. Um, you know, she doesn't say very much. She doesn't yeah. have very much dialogue. Uh, so yes. a lot of it is just me. And um, I really connect to her loneliness and how bored she is with the world. Yeah. Sometimes I can feel like that too. I can just, I forget sometimes, you know, like what it is. I don't want to get too depressing, but but I really do sometimes feel the same feelings that she feels. Same with me, yes. And Lily has this talent to write them. I mean, the lines that you wrote for us, they're, they're so philosophical, some of them. You know? It's so... Uh, it, it just... Uh, it's actually what, what I really feel about life as well. So, about yeah, the, lonely, she... the loneliness part of it. You know? She wrote the parts for us too, so yes. she knew us, so she kind of made it close to who we are too. So it was easy to just slip into the part. Uh, and you owe it well the, your, your relation with uh, Marshall. With Mar it was very special um, because I, I, I love Marshall very much, and it was, I mean, in, in the film I'm supposed to kind of, you know, have this heroin addict dad who I promised to my mom to, who has passed away in the yes. film. I, to, I gave this promise to my mom to take care of my dad, but he is a burden somehow, you know, he's, he's a, like a very heavy weight pulling me down and making my life not really, uh, not really good. easy and it make, makes, it, makes it tryst and um, and uh, that that was really because Marshall in real life is so different to his character. Yeah. He did it He's so such well. A sweetheart. Yeah. Yeah. He did it so well. He's really a sweetheart. And um, it was just very special to have this love and hate affair, uh, love and hate relationship with yes. him. What what is your future project? Uh, I don't know. Not, <laughs> not yet. What do you, tell, you tell me. <laughs> and what about you? I'm working on a TV show yes. right now, an American TV show called State of Affairs. And it'll be on TV in November. It's about the CIA and the people that work with the President of the United States. <laughs> very different. Yes. <laughs> But kind of the same. Thank you very much. Thank you so thank much. You. Thank you. <laughs>